Okay, with power carving, sometimes your bits can kind of add up really fast and get really expensive. Today I want to show you a way of allowing your diamond bits to last a lot longer than they did before. When you're carving, you eventually get a little bit of gunk buildup between the grid of this diamond, of this diamond bit. That can be caused from the, the wood burning, from pitch in the wood, several different things. But what it does is it coats it so it makes it so the diamond bits aren't doing, or the diamond grit isn't doing its job of doing the cutting and the, uh, the cutting away. And so today I'm going to show you a product called the Diamond Cleaning Block that you can use in conjunction with your diamond bits to help clean those up to clear out all that gunk and debris to allow your bits, your, the diamond grit of your bit, to start doing their job again. So what I'm going to do, I've got my, um, my rotary tool here. I've, I'm going to slide in the, uh, the collet reducer and then my, my bit. Lock it in place. I'm going to turn it to launch about a medium speed. All I want to do is take this and touch it against this diamond, diamond block. And what it's doing is it's taking all of that gunk in between all the, 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 the diamonds and just cleaning that right out, kind of flushing it out. Sometimes people have seen this with the abrasive cleaners for sandpaper. The concept is the same. We're just going through and cleaning that right out. One thing to be sure of, though, is only use this with your, with your diamond bits. Never use it with your carbide bits. It will build them really quick. Now, after I've done that, I've now exposed more grit and gotten the gunk out of it. And this bit should last me at least three or four times as long as it would before without using this diamond cleaning block. 